Welcome back to J Stories, where ideas and technology from Japan help solve global social and environmental problems. I'm Toshi Maeda, and here's a quick look at this week's J Stories. Over the decades, Japan has gained a reputation for cutting edge robotics, and this week we take a look at two stories that indicate Japan may still be at the forefront of developments in this technology. Back in 2020, Hinotori became the first Japan made robot assisted surgery system to win manufacture and sales approval from the Japanese government. Hinotori's nimble arm movements during surgery can reduce blood loss and speed up recovery. The system is already available at more than 30 Japanese medical facilities and has been used to treat 900 patients to date. Hinotori is more compact than its older competitor, the Da Vinci system developed in the United States. Its cockpit, meanwhile, has been designed to fit the typical body shape of Japanese surgeons, making long surgical procedures more comfortable for local medics. Its makers hope to soon sell the robot abroad, particularly in Asia. HAL, or Hybrid Assistive Limb, is another medical robot, but unlike Hinotori, the device is wearable. HAL has skin sensors that detect instructions from the wearer's brain before the exoskeleton like device helps move their limbs. It is particularly useful during the rehabilitation of people with injuries or disabilities. The robotic device is part of something its maker, the Tsukuba based Cyberdyne, calls Cybernix, a vast research field that includes robotics, medicine, engineering, and much more. Cyberdyne is promoting this new field. Through an investment fund, assisting business tie ups and setting up research hubs. The company's CEO, Yoshiyuki Sankai, told J Stories that he believes bureaucratic barriers between research fields should be broken down. His ultimate aim, he says, is for technology like Cybernix to help create a more inclusive society that looks after everyone. That's all for this week from J Stories. Please visit our website at jstories.media for more details on these stories. And please like and share our videos and subscribe to our channel and newsletter if you haven't. Thank you for watching and stay tuned for more solutions and inspiration from Japan.